My name is Dr. Nicole Heller. I'm the curator of the Anthropocene at the Carnegie Museum of Natural History. The Anthropocene is a newly proposed geological epoch that we're just in now. And it relates to all of the changes that are happening and that are observed by Earth system sciences in the planetary system, so the functioning of the Earth itself. And unfortunately, many of these changes are really inhospitable to life. So it's a really important moment in time for us to grapple with these changes and find a more sustainable role for human beings in natural history and in nature itself. I've been studying the Anthropocene really my whole career, though I didn't really use that term. I think it's hard to do ecology and not study the Anthropocene because animals and plants all over the world are completely influenced by human activities. My first research experience was as a junior in college and I went off to study in what I thought would be a really remote, uh, far off place, sort of what we consider pristine nature. And even there, what I observed was the big changes there were in the abundance and diversity of animals on these islands because fishermen left behind goats and they introduced rats and cats that just completely transformed the ecology of these places. So from that point on in my career, I kind of had this deep understanding that really to do ecology, to understand what's going on, um, we need to think very carefully about human behavior and the role that humans are having in ecosystems. The Anthropocene Living Room is uh, a new space in the museum that was inspired by the success of a temporary exhibit that ran from 2017 through 2018. That exhibit was called We Are Nature, Living in the Anthropocene. And it was an exhibit that drew from all of our different collections from biology, anthropology, geology to really show the ways in which human activities have been transforming species on this planet and transforming processes. And people really liked it. They found it interesting and they asked us to do more, to keep this conversation going. So one element from We Are Nature was a kind of a sitting room area. And so we took that part of the exhibit and brought it here and kind of increased it a little bit with the idea that we use this space to keep sharing parts of our collection and how they can help us understand the Anthropocene and also to share contemporary science that relates to issues people are reading about in the news that share some of the science that um, the researchers here at the museum do and also contemporary literature and books about changes you could make in your life and then also art that we find inspiring. My hope is that people take away several things from the Anthropocene living room. I hope primarily that they can come into this space and learn something new, uh, make a connection to their life that's meaningful to them. This is a place that we want to also learn from our visitors and the people that visit us here so that we can see what they're interested in, what they want to learn more about, how can we really help people have enjoyable experiences, relaxing experiences, fun experiences, but also um, gain information about the really important topics in our life, like the Anthropocene and natural history.